In today's close-up, we have some good news to share about endangered animals that are being discovered across Korea. Of course, it's only natural that preservation efforts should follow. Here are some scenes of golden bats and otters that are rarely encountered by humans. An orange-whiskered bat, also known as a golden bat, has an orange-colored body. Their gender ratio is unbalanced, and as their numbers in general have significantly dropped due to the destruction of their ecosystem, the bats are protected as level one endangered species. An orange-whiskered bat has been found at Kim Yong-gul Cave on Jeju Island. The bat was found in hibernation during a regular inspection of caves last month, conducted by the Jeju headquarters of the World Natural Heritage Management Bureau. The same type of bat was found in 2008 at Manjangul Cave in Jeju, which is designated as a UNESCO World Heritage. The animal seems to have expanded its habitat. An orange-whiskered bat was discovered for the first time in Jeju in 1981 on Halasan Mountain. Since, spottings have occurred in five locations, including the two caves. Only some 200 of the bats are believed to exist in Korea. They're sensitive to the environment and are regarded as an indicator of air pollution levels. 만장구리에서 이제 김영구래까지 이제 붉은 박제가 발견됐다는 것은 어, 아무래도 이제 사람 출입이 이제 통제돼 있고 주변 이제 자연 환경이 잘 보존되어 있던 결과라고 이제 생각할 수 있겠습니다. Now that their habitats are being found across Jeju's natural heritage sites, this all the more calls for the need to better preserve the environment. Otters were once a very common creature found in Korean streams, but now, with their numbers drastically fewer, they're designated as a natural monument as well as a level one endangered species. In recent days, otters have been found near the Hangang River for the first time in some 40 years. An otter family of four has been spun. 물고기 비늘도 보이고 뼈도 보이잖아요. 이제 이쪽을 보시면 오리류라든지 이제 그런 걸 잡아먹은 배설물이 되죠. Since KBS reported last year that a single otter was found at the Hangang River in March, environment authorities installed 10 security cameras in the area and verified the habitation of an otter family. The otter in the KBS report is believed to be one of the baby otters of the family. Officials are reviewing various measures to foster a stable environment in the river area for the otter family, the first to return in four decades.